where the Korean government start to organize the national information network uh, for five public business domain in 1988. Then from that time on, the government uh, implemented series of ICT policies to improve the performance of the network system. So as a, as a result of that, uh, the number of subscribers to the broadband com, uh, service and the quality of the broadband service uh, has been ranked world number one so far. We do business uh, on the internet right now, and we do banking transactions on the internet. And also, we buy things through the internet. So statistics show that the information infrastructure increase uh, the GDP by 2.5%. And also, it increase uh, the productivity of the labor by 1.5%. It, it increased the, the employment by 1.5%. So, uh, as everybody knows, the ICT facility can affect the national economy very much. Well, there are many examples uh, that uh, has been affected by the information technology. But uh, in 1999, the President of the United States, Bill Clinton, announced that the United States discovered the genomic sequencing um, map uh, by the information system. At the time, it took 16 years, and the uh, uh, United States invested $3 billion. But now, the same job can be done in one or two days in Korea uh, with just $1,000. So that's, uh, uh, I think, the most uh, uh, breakthrough uh, affected by the information technologies. Well, I think it's great in the sense that we can hear many stories of innovation from many corners of the society in one place. I think it's very great.